Senator McCain shut down his campaign this week in order to deal with the economic crisis. What's your opinion of this potential $700 billion bailout? Like every American I'm speaking with, we are ill about this. We're saying, hey, why bail out Fannie and Freddie and not me? But ultimately what the bailout does is help those that are concerned about the health care reform that is needed to help shore up our economy, to help... Um, it's got to be all about job creation, too. Also, to shoring up our economy and putting Fannie and Freddie back on the right track. And so health care reform and reducing taxes and reining in spending, because Barack Obama, you know. Uh, you know, we've got to accompany tax reduction and tax relief for Americans. Also, having a dollar value meal at restaurants, <laughs> that's going to help. But one in five jobs being created today under the umbrella of job creation that you know also <laughs> Why isn't it better, Governor Palin, to spend $700 billion helping middle-class families who are struggling with health care, housing, gas, and groceries? Allow them to spend more and put more money into the economy instead of helping these big financial institutions that played a, a role in creating this mess. That's why I say I, like every American I'm speaking with, we're ill about this position that we have been put in where it is the taxpayers looking to bail out. But ultimately what the bailout does is help those who are concerned about the health care reform that is needed to help shore up our economy. Um, helping the, oh, It's got to be all about job creation too, shoring up our economy and, and putting it back on the right track. So health care reform and reducing taxes and reining in spending has got to accompany tax reductions and tax relief for Americans and trade, we have we've got to see trade as opportunity, not as a, a competitive, um, scary thing. But one in five jobs being created uh, in the trade sector today, we, we we've got to look at that as more opportunity. All those things under the umbrella of job creation, this bailout is a part of that.